long as United want me, then you know I'm happy to stay here. You can speculate, we could have opinions. It won't matter a dicky bird. The player is, says he's adamant he wants to leave. We are as amused as anyone can be because we can't quite, quite understand why he'd want to leave. And it was a shock. Wayne Rooney has this evening confirmed that he wants to leave Manchester United. Who does he think he is? Manchester United will be here a long time before Wayne Rooney. They'll be here a long time after he leaves. If Alex Ferguson is being bullied by a player and his agent, how wrong is the game? I don't think that there are uh, 100 uh, fantastic players in the world. There are uh, maybe 15 that change uh, uh, a squad in, in the sum. If uh, there is a good player that uh, could change uh, something for us, we can, we can talk about this. Some players like to think it's better world somewhere else. What is really important is for us to put this to bed. And so it has. At the start of the week, they were the club that could no longer guarantee success to their star player. Now United have opened their arms to Wayne Rooney for another five years. This week's been a joke really, hasn't it? I mean, he should have signed it months ago. Should have said what he said. Should have just kept himself quiet and signed the contract in the first place. He's made himself look a bit of a fool now, hasn't he? I'm sure um, the fans have, you know, have been upset over the last few days with, um, obviously, with everything he they've heard in, in, um, in the media, but... You know, um, my message is I've, uh, I care for this club, I, I, I want to be here. Um, I think that's important to know and, um, you know, I want to continue being successful at this club. In publicly doubting United's ambition, Rooney delivered the truth that dare not speak its name at Old Trafford. Having seen Ronaldo and Tevez leaving their prime, this one would have clearly fanned the flames of the anti-Glazer masses. I do think that the way it's worked out, everyone's a winner. I think Wayne Rooney will be forgiven very quickly. Sir Alex Ferguson's a winner, he's got his best player. And if they've managed to persuade the Glazers that they need more investment to keep their best players, then that is a, another tremendous victory for everybody at United. So Alex may have got his man, but at what cost? Rooney's criticism and its timing just two hours before a Champions League game has angered not only the supporters, but his teammates. He apologised to me this morning and the players and I think he'll do that with the fans, which is important, because we've all been hurt by the, the events of the last couple of days. But, you know, it's always, I always feel it's a quality in a person when he says he's sorry. Rooney may have apologised to the manager and the team, but how much his reputation has been tarnished remains to be seen. People love a flawed hero more than just a hero. There, there was a weakness there, and he's... He's come back from that weakness. He, he stayed true to the United cause, and I think they will, they will love him all the more for that. The image of Rooney as a boy from the back streets of Liverpool who just wanted to play football is now consigned to the past in a week that could prove to be a seminal moment for the club and the player.